Hey guitar buddies, let's check out Prince and Screwdriver. Okay, so that's the main chord sequence for the song. And those chords repeat throughout the whole song and so what we've got is very straightforward two bars of B okay and then I'm playing an A suspended second so A E and B so five seven nine then back to B and then repeats from the start. Then I play an E. You could just play an E, but the first time Prince adds a little C sharp in there as well, the sixth note. So I'm just playing, uh, adding C sharp on the fourth fret of the A string. Back to the A9, A suspended second, sorry. B. And we stop on a B. Now there's also a few little riffs over those chords you can add. So on verse 2 we get... So I'm just on there playing... Adding an E and an A under that B chord. So I'm already playing with the B chord, nine and nine. So I just take those off because I'm already barring with my first finger, that, that E and A, just to get. Okay, so we can put that in. And then we've also got So there's that riff in there as well. F sharp, G, F sharp, A, F sharp, G sharp, F sharp. So two, four, two, five, two, four, two. For the guitar solo, I've added a wah wah pedal and put the chords on a loop. Okay, so what I'm playing there is start with this little phrase. So I'm playing D to D sharp, then A. So starting on the G string, 7, 8, and then on the B string, 10. Then back to 7. And, and plenty of uh, a bend on that and some vibrato. Play that twice, and then I play the seven and seven, D and F sharp. Again, with a slight little snappy bend. Then a B, and again. Okay, then the first phrase. And then I'm playing G sharp and D, kind of very rock and roll with a slight bend. So, 9 and 10 on the B and E strings. So, and then, then playing that again. Then going F sharp, D, B. And then as we go to the E chord, we go. 
So I'm bending from an E to an F sharp. Then three times. Releasing to the E. To D. And to B. So to nine, to seven, to nine. Then A, D, B. Seven, seven, nine. And then a little trill, A, B, A, G sharp, then F sharp, so seven, nine, seven, six, then nine for the F sharp on the A string, back to G sharp, six on the D string. And then just play the chord to finish it off. You'll also hear a little Chuck Berry style lick in the song. Classic rock and roll. I'm just sliding up to seven and seven. F sharp and B. And then slide it again. Then playing E and G sharp on nine and nine on the G and B strings. And then D and F sharp. Maybe with a little song. Slight snatch on seven and seven. The song ends with two solos. So what I'm playing there is, it's kind of a flute guitar kind of mix, maybe a synth flute there. So what we've got is a B to A, 12 to, uh, 12 to 10, twice, a 9, G sharp, G sharp, A, G sharp, then F sharp on 7. Then, then I'm playing an E, and I'm going to do a little slide from a G, G sharp to B, A, or you could play the A if you want to. So, and then a B, and on the when the B stops, we do a little run in conjunction with the bass. So I'm bending from A to B to A. So bending on seven, up to nine and back down. Then chromatically down nine, eight, seven, G sharp, G, F sharp. Then a D on five, and then a B. For the final solo, Etc. So what we're playing there is same as before, same as the first solo. We play that three times, and then then we got just a hammer from a D to a D sharp. Then again. And then I play a bend this time from C sharp to D sharp and also picking the D sharp on four. So bending six to eight and also playing four. And then E on 12, D sharp, C sharp, B. So 12, 11, nine, 
seven. Okay, and then at the end, it goes to an E chord on the stop. Okay, and then we've got. Whatever you really want to over there, it's just uh, very much like kind of let's go crazy style, a big E note. And then some little just run down the uh, the E blues scale and you could put lots of like uh, crazy kind of slides in there and before it ends on a B. So uh, great rock and roll tune. Enjoy Screwdriver. <laughs> 